All right, welcome to my December 18th live item shop review video. As you can see in the top right, we do have a downloadable update tonight. There's a big movement change. Apparently I did a separate video on that. If you want to check it out, I'm pretty sure it's going to be the last update for a while because all the Epic employees are going on winter vacation. Before I get started though, I did want to do a quick shout out to my friend Felix, him and his wife, Linda have been married for 20 years. 20 years that is mind-boggling it's every man's dream to get married but to stay married for over 20 years that's a true achievement so happy 20th anniversary linda i hope you enjoy your purse and your cardigan sweater all right what do we got in the item shop here looks like this part is all the same the gear for festival that's the weekend still here the jam tracks nothing has changed here i'm pretty sure all the jam tracks are now available so pick and choose what you want they are still 500 a pop and then we got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles stuff. Unfortunately, the emotes are not out yet. I don't know if they scrapped them or what. You can't see the instruments anymore either. Start Your Engines tab is the same. Diesel Bundle, Cyclone Bundle, Jaeger 619 Bundle, all the same. Under the Lego tab, we've got the Signature Style, so the Neon Glow Bundle is now out. I don't think this has been out yet since Lego has released. That looks pretty cool. I like that for Night Light. Here's Light Show. Look at that hair. It's pink. He doesn't have pink hair, does he? No, that's red maroon. That's kind of weird. I wonder why they made it pink. Still, that's pretty sweet. I like both of these in the Lego form. Hush Bundle's still here. We've seen that from a few days. Then the Fortnite Flare, they updated this a bit. We got Birch, Kuno, Envoy, and two emotes. So Birch was a skin that a lot of people didn't buy, I don't think. She has two styles, Guardian and then no mask. But let's take a look at her Lego version. It's not bad, I guess. I like the long hair. Pretty cool. How about Kuno? What does she look like in Lego format? Yeah, that's pretty solid, like a ninja. I like that. Envoy? Ha, <laughs> she looks like a Matrix character. That's pretty cool. I love the Lego characters. Then we got Breaking Point. That's a cheap one. 200. And Steamed. Yeah, that's not bad. Winterfest tab, this is still the same. Dandy Kane bundle. Fish Stick. Holly Striker, those are all the same. The Jujutsu Kaisen stuff is all still here. Rick Grimes from The Walking Dead, as well as Daryl and Michonne still here. But look at this, the return of the Terminator bundle. Terminator himself, the HK Aerial, the Poly Alloy pickaxes, and the Tow Truck Surfer Traversal Emote. I love this one. Peely drives it, just like the bad guy in Terminator 2. Oh, it's playing copyrighted music, I forgot. Crap. And let's see, is there a Lego version? Unfortunately, no, no Lego version in the Terminator set. You do have the Skynet Llama, that was pretty sweet. And yeah, that's about it. Pretty cool though, the return of Mr. Arnold. Terminator, great skin. He does have the battle damaged style, which I think is arguably cooler. His endoskeleton sticks out there and you can take his sunglasses off, but you can see the red light regardless through the glasses if you want. Not bad, a great skin from the Future War set. Good stuff, but other than that, they just changed a few skins in the Lego department, and that's about it. So, big update tonight. Last update for a while. Movement changes and some bug fixes, I think. That's about all there is to it. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaperTime.